Hello everyone. Today I'm going to be sharing the box by Fashionsta and I was very happy with the October box. The first item that I took out of the box was the vitamin C tea infused serum and it's made by the company Tiami. The bottle comes with one ounce of product. It retails for $45. It's made in the United States, cruelty free and perfect for all skin types. The product absorbs quickly into the skin. The package says it takes about 30 seconds to absorb. This is great if you're trying to move quickly with your daily beauty routine. The color is very noticeably pink and it also has a light grapefruit scent. The directions are to apply one to three pumps to your fingertips and gently smooth onto the skin, working in small circles and that for best results, you should apply the serum both morning and night after cleansing your face. This is me attempting to and failing at showing you this product. The Natural Rescue Balm for Dry Bits is made by the company every day. The balm contains 0.5 fluid ounces. It retails for $15. It's made in Australia. It's paraben and petroleum free. The claim is that they do not test on animals, they never use animal products, and never use nasty stuff. It's formulated with papaya, antioxidant-rich acai, emollient sunflower seed oil, and soybean germ extract that moisturizes your lips and other body bits. The instructions are easy. You just apply to your lips or wherever you need the hydration and reapply as needed. Keep in mind that this balm is peppermint scented, so you will feel a slight tingle on your lips when you apply it. Something to keep in mind if you apply it to other areas. This next product is by Gerlactic. It is their long lasting matte lip paint <laughs> liquid lipstick duo. It's made in the US. It retails for $26. Each pot is 0.12 fluid ounces. The shades are Allure and Posh. The first original double-ended matte lip paint, a color-rich creamy formula that's weightless on the lips and delivers long-lasting coverage that's transfer-proof with no cracking or bleeding. The colors can be worn individually or together in an ombre look. The Sigma F89 Bake Kabuki Brush is made in China. It retails for $25. Its recommended use is with powder. It has a clear indentation, which I've seen a lot of people uh, look at and think that it's um, damaged, but no, this was intentional. The next item is the Leopardina Palette made by Rude Cosmetics. Uh, this retails for $21.50. It's made in China. It is paraben and cruelty free. Each eyeshadow is uh, 1.35 grams or 0 0.047 ounces. And as for the, uh, the highlighters, each one is 3.25 grams or 0.114 ounces. This palette features 12 eyeshadows and four highlighters. Of the 12 eyeshadows, eight are matte and four are shimmers. The color scheme for this palette is nudes. The palette itself has a decent sized mirror. The intention behind the color story is that you can use these colors for everyday use. The colors complement any complexion. The shimmer shades and the darker hues are intentional so that you can go from a day to night look using this palette. The Oil to Foam Jet Cleanser is made by a company called Double Dare. It retails for $25. It's made in Korea. The bottle contains 80 milliliters. Uh, 
The instructions are that you should dispense two to three pumps onto your palm and gently massage your face to remove makeup and impurities. Then you add lukewarm water to create foam and then apply lather onto the face in circular motion to cleanse and finally rinse with water. So, some of you may already know, the box does not come in variations. Every subscriber receives the same items. The box, the price of the box is $19.99 and it usually ships toward the end of the month. Thank you all for watching my video. Please like, subscribe, and share, and I'll see you in the next one.